Court Crew and welcome back to the channel. It's your girl Courtney Janine and I'm back with another video. Today's video is going to be another wig review. Thank you so much to Alche for sending me today's unit. Today I will be reviewing Alche Perfect Hairline in the style Bexley in the color 27. If you would like to see how I installed this unit, get the key features of the Perfect Hairline collection and would like to see the pros and cons and my final thoughts on this unit then definitely keep watching before we get into it if this is your first time seeing me here on the yt hi my name is courtney janine i do beauty fashion and lifestyle content here on this channel so definitely subscribe join the Corku family down below and let's get into today's video all right you guys before i show you all how i installed this unit let's go ahead and talk about the key features you might be familiar with the perfect hairline collection but it's been a minute since Audrey has dropped a new unit from this line so let's go ahead and go over the key features this unit comes with fully hand tied 13 by 6 frontal you might notice that some perfect hairline units come with 13 by 4 some come with the 13 by 6 and this one is a 13 by 6 it comes with ear to ear soft hd transparent lace and with this hd transparent lace you definitely want to be careful because it is super soft so just taking your time even if you choose to pluck your unit that could result in some holes so definitely be gentle with this lace next it comes with natural baby hairs pre-attached elastic band pre-plugged hairline and heat styling friendly up to 400 degrees this unit is 28 inches and yeah i think those are all the key features this unit comes in a number of specialty colors you might even notice that i picked up a number 27 which is not often a color that is offered so i decided to get it you'll hear my thoughts on this color later on in the video but yeah it comes in chocolate swirl cinnamon wine red velvet golden honey blonde golden amber ginger brown and butter toast are right, you guys so i am going to let you see how i installed this unit you might notice that it isn't totally all 27 because I did put in a little bit of a dark root so if you like to see how to dark root your synthetic wigs then definitely keep watching and also if you just want to see how I installed this unit then definitely keep watching and stay to the end to see my pros cons and final thoughts on this unit you ain't even gotta say it the sun good don't need to be complicated you know we good no reason to be explaining just give me loyalty cause love is overrated Yeah, yeah, yeah I know you love when we shady Duh, duh, they hate it when we isolated You know we good, no reason to be explaining Just want your loyalty, the love is overrated Are you down to bleed the streets with me? Or could you be blind to my heart inside you see? I'm willing to give you all this love I got pros and cons and my final thoughts i'm going to start with my cons so that we end on a positive note in terms of my cons this color it's a con personally for me i'm not the hugest fan of this color on my skin and i'm glad i still tried it out because i wasn't sure if i would like it or not because yeah i just hadn't seen anyone with my complexion do a synthetic wig in this color before so i was like let me try it out let me try something different i honestly think that i would definitely like this unit a lot more in a more natural color or even a chocolate swirl but that doesn't really cloud my opinion on this unit overall let me know what you think about this color in the comments below the next kind that i have is the shedding and tangling i will say that it tangles a lot so that you'll get just a couple of snags and you can easily brush them out but when you brush them out sometimes hair comes out so that's usually tangling and shedding goes hand in hand but i do want to note that because as you can see my hands are going through this hair really easily and let me tell you why so i've been using this demert wig and weave detangler spray it on my hair brush it through and it is good to go depending on the unit you might have to spray a couple times throughout your day or if it doesn't tangle that bad you can just spray in the morning and you should be good for the day so yeah i will have this link down below if you are on the hunt for a good detangler for your synthetic wigs this works miracles and i absolutely love it if you have this spray you don't even need to worry about it being a little tangly because look child i spray this through this hair 
and I ain't getting a snag since, okay? And that is kind of it for my cons. The only thing that I want to know was this color and the tangling and shedding. So let's go ahead and move on to my pros. You guys, this unit really came pre-plugged. I feel like it was really pre-plugged. The baby hairs were baby hairy. I did not use any baby hairs today, but they were there. So I really did like the pre-pluckedness. I loved the hair like the hair quality i feel like i'll try never misses with this hair quality i did put heat to it i did not get any pushback or anything like that the texture is nice this unit is on the silky side um i wouldn't even say it's a yakky mix it is a very long unit so i feel like a lot of the girls like a long unit and this is 28 inches so you would definitely get a lot of length with this unit i love how versatile the perfect hairline collection is so you're able to get parting versatility even on the stock card one of the models has braids in her hair so you can do any type of style with this sort of unit because you have that 13 by 6 frontal the lace melted beautifully which i absolutely love and that is like a given with outre's lace it's always top tier what else would i say about this hair um oh units of this wig reminds me of this reminds me of a older sister of lynette i feel like this unit is really giving me lynette Vibes. I do think that Lynette was more on the yakky side, so that's just one thing to note. But I feel like they are like long lost sisters. Like this unit is just a little bit longer, but other than that, I do see a lot of similarities with um just the pre-plackness, the meltness, the hair like it just is really giving me a longer version of lynette really briefly you guys i want to touch on the price usually when i do these new wig releases the units aren't up on the wig sites yet but this is up on wig types already and it is going for around 52 dollars so i imagine this to go for around 50 to 60 dollars depending on which site you pick it up at i do think that she's worth the price especially for this length you guys know with outre julianne 24 that was in like the 70s and this this is 28 inches and it's still in the 50s so i feel like the price is really good for what you're getting in terms of the hair length and the hair quality the pre-pluckness all that but yeah you guys all in all i think that this unit is really pretty i definitely think that i would enjoy and wear this unit a lot more if i got a more natural color but you always just want to try something once okay let me know your thoughts on this color let me know if you're thinking of picking up bexley and i will see you guys in my next one bye guys with wearing it. Time ain't free, so if you got it, you cherish it. You know the call never switch. My love to the cheek. You know I'ma go all out for my dream. If we ever fall out, get it good, get it right back. And if it's up, let it stick. And it's like that. You ain't even gotta say it. Misunderstood, don't even be coming.